My name is uh, Mike Demopoulos, and yes, I'm very cool for you to take a video of me. There's like this interesting uh, thing about security. I always tell people that a lot of the CMSs are all secure at core, but then you install all these third-party extensions and that's the power of WordPress is these hundreds of thousands of wonderful plugins that can extend it in themes. Whenever you introduce additional things, it adds different security layers of risk. And yeah, if you never install anything, WordPress is very secure, but who has a WordPress site that is 100% just core and nothing else? You gotta be very careful and security should always be top of mind um, in anything that you do, no matter what site you have. If it is a public facing site, I always try to use a minimum of a web application firewall, something that doesn't live on the application layer of WordPress so that it doesn't kill any of the performance of the speed and that the DNS that routes through um, the firewall and then it will stop the attacker there. You have to do a little things on the HT access to make sure people that really know what they're doing can't get in the back doors. But before I had this job, um, I did freelancing. I did um, websites for banks and credit unions. Um, we had everything route through uh, um, web application firewall providers. Uh, actually, before I did had this, I was at an agency and we were we were one of the beginning agencies that were part of the agency program when you guys launched that. And it's a revenue generator. Man, it's a revenue generator. We had clients that didn't want to deal with security and they had decent budgets. And we could say, hey, we can get take care of security. We were able to mark it up like 10X on what we were paying. And we never had anybody complain about the cost. And the rare time, like the one time that we had a hack after it was installed, it was cleaned up within minutes. Security sells if you know how to sell it. It's when people sell it as an afterthought, it should be part of that first discussion. And you can be known as the provider that cares about security and privacy and everything else. But that should be part of the initial discussion with the client, not an afterthought at the end.